While crews are still working to put out the fire, visitor traffic has returned to the rim drive. The West Rim Drive was opened at 8 o'clock this morning, so access is available to everybody. The fire is burning in a remote area just southwest of the rim. The Bybee fire was sparked on July 28th and has since grown to nearly two square miles in size. As of 9 Monday morning, crews had contained about 73% of the 1,072-acre fire. Mostly this, this fire was fought by hand crews, so they're hiking down into the bowl every morning. Some of them are staying down there overnight. The fire hasn't dampened the enthusiasm of visitors to the park. We weren't really too concerned. We figured if something was to go on, they would get us out in time. We saw on your news program with the status of the fire and came up today knowing that the road was open. While the cause of the fire is still under investigation, it's believed that it was human caused. At one point, an ember sparked a fire just inside the caldera rim, and the park remains hazy in some areas. While the West Rim Drive has reopened to traffic, visitors will want to keep an eye out for fire personnel and emergency crews. At Crater Lake National Park, Lyle Ahrens, NBC2 News.